Hi, Kim with Floor Express, and I am here to show you the samples for week 35, which is August 24th, and thanks so much for taking the time to look. We'll start with the one gallons. This is your Dwarf Mondo, it's nice and full, and we have our regular Mondo, just want you to see the size of that. Also, um, we have some different Ajugas. The Black Scallop is the sample I have today. It's nice and retail ready. Um, Sun Hosta, Sun Hostas are looking good. There's no color on them, but they're getting nice and full. We do have a new crop of the Belize Gara Dark Pink. I know last week we had an older crop, it's a little taller, but this is a nice new fresh crop. Um, the Red Sensation Cordyline. It's wonderful to put in your uh, pots and the containers. Also for the Crotons, we have Croton Mammy and Croton Petra, and those are two per. On the Dianellas, the same as last week. Again, nice and full, real clean. And then we do have milkweed this week. We had scarlet and the yellow, and they're nice. They, we do not spray any of our milkweed. They're um, super great for the butterflies. Also, um, salvias, we had several. We had Mystic Spires, I think I have that in here. Um, the Black and Bloom, this is Black and Bloom. Looks good, it's got some color coming on, retail ready. And as far as lantanas go, we have New Gold. Um, there was a Lavender Lantana. Then we have an, our crop of Anne Marie is a little larger, so if you need it for landscape jobs and you want something nice and full, I would get the Anne Marie. But the Bloomify Rose looks just like the Anne Marie and it's nice and tight. As far as pentas, pentas are looking good. They all have nice color on them. We have graffitis, bee brights, lucky stars, so check that out on the availability. Um, the Coreopsis, these are looking really good. This is the Uptick series. This one's got buds getting ready to open. It'll look good by next week as far as more color. And this, this is the gold and this is the yellow red. Uh, let's see, we have some Veronicas. I think we have white and purple. There's a leaf in here my trees. Um, anyhow, they've got buds all on them, starting to show good color. Okay. Oh, this is the Kufia Floor Glory I told you about last week. This is the new hybridized um, heather. It's nice and tight, has good coloring, and this is the Diana Magenta. It's actually my favorite because it's nice and bright, but we do have it in lavender, and it looks just like the regular heather that you're used to. Um, Crown of Thorns. The reds are looking really good. Red Gundula. And then we also have the Cadillac Pink. We also had some yellow Denny's on there, so if you need yellow. And then Dianthus. We're starting to get into the season for Dianthus. And this is the Mountain Frost Rose Bouquet. And it gets about 12 inches tall. Um, it mounds real nice, has really good color. Um, this is a real favorite. It was a really good seller last year. Ficus Reppens, nice and full. We have a new crop of the oysters. Looking good, and that's just the bicolor blew my mind. This is my sample from last week, so the color has been sitting in the shade, but the blew my minds are really nice right now. Um, we also have our four, um, four inch burpee tomatoes. I think there's like eight different varieties, so check it out on the avail. I know they look really small, but believe me, by mid next week, they're gonna be about six inches tall. Um, the Jasmine Minima four inch, we also have the summer sunset Jasmine. And then this is another one in the Mountain Frost Bouquet um, family, and this is the Pink Twinkle. One gallon jasmine. And let me walk, go on this side real quick, and I'm just gonna show you our Foxtail one gallon. For the size, they're not very big, but they're nice. And then here's your Super Blue and the Isabella more things here. Your Aztec looks really nice. And then Mystic Spires. It's got color on it starting up. Actually, this is the Black and Bloom. Let me find, where's the Mystic Spires? I have it here somewhere. Oh, I don't have it. Sorry, I thought I did. Well, I think that's it for the one gallon. So there's lots more on the avail, so check it out. And if I can help you in any way, please give me a call. Thanks so much.